If you want to get started uploading videos to YouTube, start here. A year ago, I made the VBR1 versus VBR2 video, and in this particular one, I'm going to upload this video with the VBR1 pass. Starting with my camera, the Fujifilm X-T3, I recorded this video in H.264, 8-bit, 420, 4K, 3840 by 2160 resolution at 100 megabits per second. I use these settings for recording the majority of my YouTube videos since I'm typically inside of my house with a static scene that doesn't require a lot of detail needing to be captured from objects in motion or complex lighting setups. Now, the quality of video isn't determined by the bitrate alone, but there are certain things I need to sacrifice when uploading to YouTube in order to have an easier time during my edit and save space on my hard drive. In addition, there's a point of diminishing returns when recording and exporting at a higher bitrate. It makes it hard to edit, isn't going to further improve the quality at some point, and is going to be significantly downgraded by YouTube when it processes the video. For those reasons, I don't fight YouTube. I match my video bitrate settings to what they recommend. audio as well. For this particular video, I'm going to export the video as 44 megabits per second and audio as stereo 384 kilobits per second. I'll let you come to your own conclusions while watching this in 4K or 1080p. Notice that my settings are H.264 format, YouTube 2160p 4K preset, Hardware encoding, I did not change. 44 megabits per second VBR1 bitrate encoding. Audio channel set to stereo with 384 kilobits per second set to bitrate. And at the bottom, I get the estimated file size for the video. So, what do you think? If you've enjoyed this video, please consider subscribing to support the channel and to prevent the YouTube algorithm from banishing this channel to the shadow room.